Comic Con 2017 is right around the corner, so I wanted to take the opportunity to share with you something that I take very, very seriously, and that is packing for the con. I'm really excited to go. I'm gonna be happy no matter what, but you know what makes me really happy? Going there with a suitcase that has all the essentials in it. So right now, I'm gonna share with you my top 10 things that I need to pack for San Diego Comic-Con. Number one on that list are my T-shirts. So we're gonna be there for about five days and you gotta have a different t-shirt for every single day. Also because the large majority of places at San Diego Comic-Con are super hot and sweaty and it's gross if you're reusing those t-shirts. So I'm bringing a whole bunch and I gotta make sure that they all have brands on them that I wanna represent. I am working on getting some IT coverage in the book. So I am gonna bring my IT t-shirt of course and then who goes anywhere without some Star Wars and all my favorite brands? So that is what this pile right here is for. Number two is probably one of the most important things to me where if I went to Comic-Con or any convention or any film festival without this stuff, I don't know if I'd be okay. And that is my protein bars. You never have an opportunity to eat three normal meals a day at a convention, especially when you're working that convention. So you gotta go prepared with stuff that you can put in your pockets, put in your backpack. And my favorite thing is my assortment of protein bars. Right now, I am super into Lara bars and RX bars because you know, we gotta be healthy people. And I hear these are bars that have very natural, healthy ingredients. So I am slightly addicted to those and I will have a whole stockpile of them going with me down to San Diego. So you remember what I said about things getting really sweaty at Comic-Con? That is why folks with bangs need to bring some hats. And I can't just bring one hat because I'm gonna be wearing that hat a lot. I'm bringing two hats. So you know what? If you see me anywhere in San Diego, there's a very good chance I'm gonna be repping some Star Wars or Jurassic Park. One thing that I've always packed for Comic-Con that I consider very, very important, but I rarely ever use are my running shoes. I go to the gym almost every single day. I love running. It's a great way to de-stress and it just makes me happy. I always think that I might have time at Comic-Con for a quick run. It never really happens, but you know what? I'm gonna feel like a pretty big sucker if I wind up with time at some point during this trip this year and I don't have my running shoes. So just in case, they're going in the suitcase too. Number five is something that's not only essential to my Comic-Con experience, it is essential to my life period. If you haven't noticed, I like to dress super comfy cozy in things that make me happy and comfortable. And the main piece for something like that, for an outfit like that, is a really great hooded sweatshirt. You know what I'm gonna do after I'm done with my interviews for the day or I've gone out at night and then I'm back in my hotel room and I wanna relax? I'm gonna put on my hoodie. So you know what? That hoodie is taking up a big chunk of that bag right now. For this one, we're going back to the workout routine slash also not workout routine. One of the greatest things about Comic-Con is yes, if you're sitting in Hall H, you're sitting there all day, your butt is in that seat, you're not moving around all that much. I don't think that's part of my plan, so that means I'm gonna be walking around San Diego the city quite a bit. And you know what I need if I'm having an opportunity like that? I gotta track my steps, because if I didn't track my steps, then did the steps ever even happen? So you know what? I'm not talking about my watch right now, that's the essential thing. It's the charger, because if I go with this watch and I don't take the charger, I'm screwed. So not only is that charger going in my bag, it's getting a very special spot in my bag, so I know I have it. This thing always goes in the side zipper. My seventh thing is more of a, a batch item type thing, so you guys might not know, I got contacts in my eyes. And one of the things that I always need to make sure I have when I'm traveling is all the essentials. I gotta have my solution, my contact lens case, and of course, my glasses and extra contact lenses just in case, because you know what, if something happens to these babies, I'm not walking around that place in my glasses, but I need those glasses before I go to bed. So you know what, this is the eye pile right here. That sounds weird, but it's okay, because I love and need this stuff. Okay, my number eight is cheating a little bit because it's something that's not going in that suitcase and it is my manicures. If you watched the Lego Race video, you know that is just a personal thing for me. I love having my nails done and when I go away on a trip and when I go to something like Comic-Con, the last thing I like to do before I hit the road is go and get a manicure. So you know what? I'm getting one for this trip. 
So number nine is something that I feel like can get often overlooked and it shouldn't be, especially if you're someone who likes to go to Comic-Con parties and I most certainly do. So you know what? When I go to parties, I gotta go back to that hotel room, I gotta drink my water and I have to have some Advil because when I get up bright and early the next morning, I wanna hit all those panels and all those interviews and feel really good. And the solution to making that happen is a combo of water and Advil. My number 10 might be the most important thing of all this good stuff over here, and that's my laptop. I can't get my work done without my laptop. If I want to watch a trailer that just dropped and do a reaction, I can't do it without my laptop. I also can't prep for my interviews without my laptop. So you know what? I need to bring this baby, I need to treat it right, I gotta make sure it's charged, and it's pretty much coming with me just about everywhere I go at San Diego Comic-Con. That is the most important thing, but you know what? All these here are my essentials. And of course, when it comes time to pack, this is what happens. Do you have your own Comic-Con or just general convention essentials that you need to travel with? Tell me about them in the comment section below. And you know what? I'll see you soon. I'll see you at Comic-Con. Bye, I'm out of here. I'm traveling. Let's go.